Eight Landers, last year you guys won NIT. This year is all about business. You're trying to do that. So what is your role as a leader this year to get to the final finish line? Um, my role this year is different. It's a little different. Um, I got to come in with more energy, uh, talking a little more, helping the older guys just, like, become comfortable. Like, I see a lot of guys be, like, a little tensed up. That's what leads to, like, some negative triggers for us. But just trying to keep my, my guys relaxed and tell the veterans that we just got to come in with energy. Monty, your first game at the college level, how did you think you performed tonight? Uh, for the first time, I do feel like I had a good overall performance, just trying to get my teammates involved, do all the little things, so so the, the whole package. There was a play um, yeah, in late first half, maybe in early in the second half, where you're dribbling mm -hmm. uh, out toward the top, uh, defender kind of in your face, clapping and smiling and trying to trying to rattle you mm -hmm. rattle your cage a little bit, and then you cut toward the basket and you hit him with a yeah. a perfect strike. Uh, just kind of if you could both describe from your different perspectives how that play developed and what what that tells you kind of about each other. <laughs> it's gonna be a long season. Mm -hmm. I mean, <laughs> the duo is gonna be crazy, but this team is way deeper and way more talented than you think. Uh, we really in sync. Like, that was just like a out of contact. Like, that was just like an eye contact play. Like, he, I seen him cutting. He was, I seen nobody was at, at, uh, next to the basket. And the defender was shorter than me, so I could see over them. So I just threw it straight to him got an easy layup. Hey, Landers, you played on the tough defensive team last year. It looked like you guys can be even better defensively. What's the ceiling on the defensive level for this team? A national championship game. I mean... We got extreme length, uh, quickness, leadership, aggressiveness, willingness. Like It's going to be a long season for anybody we play. Landers, you came off the bench and scored a, a ton. You seem pretty comfortable with it. Is that – do you care whether you come off the bench or start this year? How, what's your, I guess, feeling on, on your role? Whether I come off the bench, I start, I don't play. I mean, my team going to win and we going to do good regardless. So me coming off the bench don't affect me or how I play or what I'm focused on. I come in the game no matter what at any point with energy, just trying to help my team win a ball game. It was both your first games uh, this season and together and with, with everybody else. What what did you guys make of We'll start with you, Imani. What, did you, what were your first impressions of how it, how it went? Uh, my first impression was like just showing like we got we got a good team we got full of talent on the team so it's really just like everybody buying in like as you can see like we kind of like in between right now but we're gonna pull together we just really just getting comfortable with each other like you said it's a new team like a whole different team more talent like freshmen on the team so we we really learning and looking up to them just trying to you know go over and just learn and over, over practice what we do and just bring it to the court. For me, it was a fun game. I mean, playing against some former guys we know um, in Memphis. So we knew they were going to come out with a chip on their shoulder. But us starting to jail, like, when the other team does that, kind of bring us even tighter. So, like, we're going to crush you and try to crush you even more. And it was just a fun day. Landers, when you said that as a duo you're going to be crazy, how do you fit together? What, are the, what do you each bring that, that fits so well, you think? Whatever I bring, he bring the other stuff, and whatever he bring, I bring the opposite. <laughs> it's uh, for real. <laughs> it's simple. For real. Landon, so I noticed last game and this game, you're pretty vocal on and off the floor. Is that kind of a role that you're just assuming? Is that something that you feel like your teammates look for, for you to speak up, you to have your eyes all over? and kind of help them when they make mistakes or when they playing well? Like, is that something that you really want to make sure you do this season? Oh, for sure. I mean, me doing that, I have fun whether I'm on the court or off the court. So when I'm, especially when I'm off the court, me seeing my guys, I get to stand up and celebrate, priceless. So I hope they expect that from me this year because they're going to get it all season. I see two more right now, Jason and then Terry. Penny just pointed out how last week fewer guys looked a little bit better, maybe a little more in sync today. More guys didn't look necessarily as in sync for for you guys as players. Mm -hmm. Is that noticeable? Like when there's more 
you know, I guess kind of cooks in the kitchen? Is it yeah, hard? definitely, especially for the ones like, like I said, the freshmen, especially for the ones like the freshmen, we fr- we all just coming in, like, trying to get a feel for each other. Like, you know, like I said, this is my first game. And my teammates, they played, some of my teammates played last week. But it was like, this is our first game together. So it was like, we really just trying to gel and, like, figure out each other's roles and, like, where we fit at. So it was like, we all just trying to gel and get comfortable with each other. For me, coming in from a veteran's perspective, I mean, I know every game is not going to be perfect. It's not going to be your game. You're not going to hit every shot. You're not going to stay in front of every defender. So it's just like you got to find something that's going to help us for you to be able to stay on the court. Anybody have anything after Terry or we'll finish up? Okay, Landers, last year the the player you were at the beginning of the year was not the player you was at the end of the year. What did you do different to make yourself better for this year, and what do you expect you to uh, contribute this year as as a player? Anything my team needs, like the first game I didn't play, so I brought energy from the bench. I'm talking to my guys about stuff I can see from off the court. This year it's going to be the same thing, whether I'm on the court or off the court. Like, you're going to hear me, you're going to see me. Anything they need, they can come to me for questions. I'm going to tell them what I see from the bench because they can't see everything because they on the court and in the action. So it's just whatever. I'm just trying to win this year. Imani, you said Jaws one of your favorite players in the NBA. How dope is the no, see? He's my favorite player. <laughs> dig that, no, dig okay. that. How dope is right. to see one a guy like that showing love to y'all on on a on a collegiate level like that, just showing love, watching y'all play. That's real good, especially for me. Like you know, he, me, and him talk before I got down here. He just told me he was gonna take me under his wing. Like we kick it off the court. Like that's my guy for real. So it's like. It's just seeing him as a big brother. He talking to me even today when he was playing, telling me like where to find find the right read, stuff like that. He was just talking to me, just making sure I keep my head in the game and just find the right people, like find the people that's open and everything like that.